Yo guys, it's Buddy72 here, and welcome to the Smelt MC server. Oops, zoomed in a bit too far there. Now this is a cross-play server where pretty much you can play on Java, and you can play on pretty much Bedrock Edition as well, plus on all the other devices. And it's going to be a, it's a six-month long server that has just opened up today. We just actually opened up in the last hour or two. And it's, yeah, going to be six months long, and so I'm just going to do... Work on little projects and try and get a nice little base up and running. And first off, this is where we come in when we first join the world. Greeted by our lovely owner, Kerr, Edemon, Light of Heaven, and the Surveyor, the Creeps. I'm sorry, I probably said your name's not the best way. There we go. Welcome to Smelt MC. Now, to start off with. We can just do the random teleport. Stay still. Come on, stay still. You can do it. Not the best builder. Oh, okay. That's taken us a fair way away. Out from spawn. But the first thing we need to try and do is collect wood. And we've got the tree fella on here, which is quite handy. Replants all the items and pulls down the trees. And we can then start off by... Crafting ourselves the table and start heading out towards the location I have picked up. Let's mine that there, place that down, and let's head out to our location. And the location I picked up is not too far from spawn. We should be able to see it within a oh, thousand or so blocks, and it's going to be just a nice little island. And so this is where we're going to be calling home for the next six months. Is we're going to be calling home on this island here. This is what we've got. It wraps around, just around the edge around here. All the frames are going. And then we've also got the little villager. All the village just here. Now progress has been slow. It has been roughly 10 days since that last clip. And yeah, I haven't done too much really. I have just done... A bit of farming and a little bit of mining that's all I've really achieved I've got a house design done up and I'm a dreadful builder so it's just gonna be what it is but this is all I have managed to accumulate so far they're not moving much because my sh crappy internet yep I still can't open chests Let's just wait a minute for it to catch up so my resources in total are not much I've got a little bit of cobble deep slate some mob loot, some random bits, a little bit of food, and yeah, all up not much. I thought I had a bit more wood, but I think I've given that away to other players. But the tree fella is so handy just being able to go along and chop down trees nice and quickly. He's going, Dook! and then it chops down that tree super quickly, and you can see my levels pop up really quick. No, stay away from me. Uh... Bad creeper. Anyway, so I need to work on... Come on, connection. I need to work on now building up a lovely little house, which I am going to do so shortly. Let's just get rid of these mobs and make it daytime. Go away. So I'm not exactly sure where I'm going to build it up, but I was thinking around here will be quite nice. I need to go level off the ground, and it's going to be facing out towards the rest of the trees here. Yeah, I could have it facing out towards the ocean. It's a bit tricky to build. I'm a shocking builder, but I shall go and start doing that there now. Oh, but first off, let's just go home. I think I've named it Home S. Yes. So I did manage to find ourselves... A lovely zombie spawner which would be handy to help get our levels up. But yeah, it's just not gonna be it's not gonna be a large massive episode that I'm doing. I'm probably just gonna do a couple and the progress is not gonna be too much as this is only a six month long server. Most of the work survival games I might do should hopefully be in the survival server up and coming in the next few weeks. We're just working on that there now, so hopefully, yeah, we'll have that open 
by next month. We shall find out. Anyway, I'm going to start working on that house and I'll show you guys some updates very shortly. Hopefully it turns out and looks alright. Okay, so here's a little progress update of what this ugly little house looks like. It is a design copied off, or slightly changed because the, um, what's it called? The deep slate did not exist back then. But this is a rough design of a house I built probably six or so years ago. It's a rough little design, it used to be cobblestone, just changing it out slightly. Still got a bit of work to go on. But here's just pretty much the upper level. We'll have another roof coming along and trying to have an enchanting set up up in the roof. And I'll probably end up, because there was a chimney here, might change it so we've got a nice view looking out to the sea. Anyway, this is just a little update to see what is going on. And hopefully we should have this here completed very shortly. Just so we've got something to move in instead of just being randomly laying out in the middle of the yeah, sun rain anyway i'm gonna go ahead and finish it off and i'll be with you guys again in a split second okay so here is some more progress update on what the house looks like nice and simple not the prettiest on the site got ourselves a little balcony up here then all my chests and stuff just dumped around for at the moment i'll hopefully build a proper storage system down here just just a whole lot of chests down here no redstone or anything that fancy then we've got ourselves a little area up top here and the next step will to be working on getting ourselves an enchanting table which should be able to fit up here nicely with all the bookshelves around just working on getting some leather in that now and we've also got another exit out the back here which just leads out to look at the lovely ocean view so what i'm going to start working on now is getting some villages up here and try and get an iron farm up and running which i'll probably have the breeder and that just located around here on the hill and the iron farm probably somewhere over here it's gonna be fun moving some of the villages that are secured down there up to here so i'm gonna go ahead and do that and the farm design is pretty much i think it was mad to fire who did the farm design so it's nice and simple so i'm probably just gonna cut the chase and get that there built up here and it's nice and simple very easy to do and then after that that's pretty much the end of the video trying to keep it nice and short it has taken quite a while to piece this short little thing together but that is time anyway let's have some stressful moments moving those villages up and over to here three hours later Okay, folks, we've now got an iron farm up and running. As you see, the iron golem just dropping down there. This is take two at recording this because I had the starting now screen taking over. But anyway, this, as suggested by the time card, it has been three hours since I started working on the lovely village breeder and the iron farm, which is great that we've finally got some progress done today. And this is really the end of the video now. I'm not going to be doing too much more. I thought just get some short little one out. Here we go. We've got a good amount of iron starting there so far. Next off, we're getting a chance and getting ourselves a bit more better higher levels. But this is the lovely little villager breeder I've got set up here. Nice and simple, self-sufficient. Two villagers. They farm and breed. Chuck items each other, three beds, so then they can breed and produce the little ones that are down here. Here we go, we've got three and two big ones now. And that is going to end it off for today's episode, nice and short on the Smelt MC server. Next time we should be working on enchanting tables and getting some better gear down. And yes, I'm talking a bit quieter now, so we've got people just outside. So anyway, thank you guys for watching this very short video, a bit mashed mash, and hopefully we do a bit better in the next coming ones. Thank you for watching, and we'll see you guys on the Smelt MC server. Goodbye.